sources of energy. What is energy? Energy is everywhere in nature. That is, energy is present in sunlight, wind, water, plants and in animals. We need energy to do all activities. Energy does things for us. Thus, energy can be defined as the ability to do work. Good source of energy. A good source of energy would be the one which would do a large amount of work per unit volume or mass, be easily accessible, be easy to store and transport, and be economical. Fossil fuel. Fossil fuel is a hydrocarbon deposit such as petroleum, coal, or natural gas derived from living matter of a previous geologic time and used for fuel. What is a power plant? A power station or a power plant is a facility for the generation of electric power. Thermal power plant a thermal power plant utilizes thermal energy of fuels such as coal, oil, natural gas or radioactive substances for the generation of electric power. Energy transformation in a thermal power plant in a thermal power plant, the chemical energy stored in fossil fuels or radioactive substances is converted successively into thermal energy, mechanical energy and finally to electrical energy. Hydro power plant In a hydro power plant, electricity is produced from water. Hydro power plants convert the potential energy of water into electricity. Wind energy. The sun causes uneven heating of the earth's surface. Air over land heats up faster than the air over water. Warm air rises up and cool air rushes in, causing movement of air. Moving air is called wind. Wind possesses kinetic energy. Uses of wind energy. Wind energy can be used to sail boats, grind grains, pump water and generate electricity. Solar energy. The sun has produced energy for billions of years. Solar energy is the solar radiation that reaches the earth. Solar energy can be converted directly or indirectly into other forms of energy, such as heat and electricity. Uses of solar energy Solar energy is used for heating water for domestic use, space heating of buildings, heating swimming pools, drying agricultural products, and for generating electrical energy. Major drawbacks of solar energy The major drawbacks of solar energy are It arrives the Earth's surface intermittently and in a variable manner. It has to be concentrated using parabolic mirrors. Biomass Biomass is an organic material obtained from plants and animals. Some examples of biomass fuels are wood, crops, manure and some garbage. Biomass contains stored energy from the sun. Plants absorb the sun's energy 
in a process called photosynthesis. The chemical energy in plants gets passed on to animals and people that eat them. Biomass is a renewable energy source because we can always grow more trees and crops. Biomass can be converted to other usable forms of energy like methane gas or transportation fuels like ethanol and biodiesel. Solar cell. A solar cell is a device that converts solar energy into electricity. A typical solar cell develops a voltage of 0.5 to 1 volts and can produce about 0.7 watt of electricity when exposed to the sun. A solar cell panel is an assembly of solar cells used to generate electricity. Uses of solar cells. Solar cells or solar cell panels are used in artificial satellites and in space probes like Mars orbiters. Wireless transmission systems or TV relay stations in remote locations. Traffic signals, calculators and in toys. Energy from the sea. The sea has long been seen as a source of energy. There are three basic ways to tap the ocean for its energy. We can use the energy of the waves, we can use the ocean's high and low tides, or we can use temperature differences in the water. Tidal energy. Tidal energy, sometimes called tidal power, is the power of wave energy, the huge moving waves, ocean thermal energy, the energy of geothermal energy, energy obtained by tapping underground reservoirs of heat, usually near volcanoes or other hot spots on the surface of the earth, is known as geothermal energy. Nuclear reactions. Nuclear reactions are those reactions wherein a nucleus, when bombarded with nucleons or other subatomic particles, undergoes a change in its composition. Types of nuclear reactions. Nuclear reactions are broadly classified as nuclear fission reaction and nuclear fusion reaction. Nuclear fission reaction. The process of splitting of a heavy nucleus into a number of light nuclei with the liberation of tremendous amount of energy and two or three neutrons is called nuclear fission. Nuclear fusion reaction. Nuclear fusion is a reaction in which two or more light nuclei Combine to form a heavier nucleus, releasing an enormous amount of energy. Nuclear fusion is the type of reaction taking place inside the sun. Inside the core of the sun, fast-moving hydrogen nuclei combine to form helium nucleus. Nuclear fusion takes place at a very high temperature of the order of 10 to the power 7 Kelvin. Hence, Nuclear fusion reaction is called thermonuclear reaction. Nuclear fusion is the basic principle of the hydrogen bomb. What is a nuclear reactor? A nuclear reactor is a device or a furnace where controlled fission chain reaction is carried out and the energy released is used to generate electricity.